KKL News 8 Storm Team Forecast with meteorologist Mary Ellen Pan. Well, thick clouds have been with us for much of the morning hours, and as we head into the afternoon, they will be very slow to break up, but I do expect some sunny breaks. Now, I can't even rule out a stray shower. I've already seen them popping up a little bit uh, across Lebanon County. Most areas, though, expected to stay dry. Temperatures will be warmer tomorrow. I do anticipate more sun, less cloud cover, and then we really start to crank up the heat and humidity as we get into Thursday and later into the week. News 8 Storm Team forecast calls for breaks of sunshine as we get into the the afternoon and then we'll see evening clearing as clouds will be getting out of here. Temperatures though in the low 70s, so cloud cover keeping those temperatures down. Mostly clear tonight, comfortable. We drop into the 50s once again, so a refreshing start to our day tomorrow. Even though it'll be warmer in the afternoon, it's still going to feel comfortable. We'll see partly sunny skies and highs in the low 80s. In your weather and health today, pond levels are moderate, thankfully. Mold levels are high, air quality is good, and the UV index with that cloud cover burn time over 40 minutes. Uh, it is moderate. As we take a look outside our Carlisle Skycam, you could see the clouds overhead, so certainly looking gloomy, but it is dry in this location. Temperatures, though, because of the clouds, are stuck in the 60s. We've got low to mid-60s at this hour. Thankfully, though, it's still comfortable. Dew points are in the 40s and 50s, and I expect it to stay comfortable tomorrow, even though we'll have temperatures in the low 80s. It'll feel a little stickier on Thursday. It will certainly be warmer, and then it looks like on Friday, the heat and humidity will definitely be feeling the mugginess as we round out the week. But that's actually going to be our next best chance for seeing uh, scattered showers and storms. So as we take a look at our live local radar, you can see the live local 8 is picking up on some sprinkles in Lebanon County. So live local 8 gets the lower levels, whereas the national weather service radars overshoot uh, the precipitation so it's good that we have that tool to show you but majority of the area is dry just dealing with that thick cloud cover now as i zoom out high pressure across the great lakes in ohio valley will slowly be building in as we head further into the uh, overnight period that's going to help break up this cloud cover as we get further into the late afternoon and the early evening so let's take a look hour by hour show you what you can expect you can see the clouds slowly eroding late in the day here and then mostly clear tonight get a little batch of clouds tomorrow morning but i do expect lots of sunshine tomorrow with just a few clouds in the afternoon especially with the winds coming out of the west and then on thursday as that high pushes off the coast we really see the winds coming in out of the southwest and pumping in the heat and humidity so certainly going to see a change uh, from what we've been enjoying the last couple of days. So 82 tomorrow, 90 on Thursday and, and Friday. Friday scattered showers and storms will help to knock down the humidity and the heat heading into Father's Day weekend. Looking fantastic with lots of sunshine. A look ahead to next week. It looks like a hot one. Could have our first heat wave of the season.